vlog and um, today is going to be a very special episode because finally we're going to be able to give you a bit of a house tour of our lovely home. For people who doesn't know us, um, we are new immigrants here in Canada. Uh, we're based here in Ottawa and we moved here like last July 2018 and like after two years um, in July 2020 we were able to purchase our new home we bought this um, during the uh, you know the first year of the pandemic it was really tough and my husband and I were just really decided that hey we need to buy a home because the rental is also like very expensive here in Canada it's been a year now and I would say that I have some observations of a typical Canadian home um, Th these are the things that we don't have uh, basically back in my country which is in the Philippines and when I moved in Singapore and in Dubai uh, we never had these amenities or these special features of the house as well so one of those things would be the fireplace of course uh, because it's really the weather here the winter is really insane so it's a gas fireplace so it let's just keep you warm and it's also really nice to have a sip of your tea or your hot chocolate during this lovely lovely cozy weather like a typical Canadian home you always find a dishwasher a lifesaver because you don't just really have to wash the dishes and the plates all the time uh, we also have a garage so garage is where you keep your stuff um, also a good uh, space saver you keep your like we, we park our car during winter you see a tons of storage as well and um, one of the things that we also have, which is very, very Canadian and I think American as well, is the basement. So basement is quite a huge area for us. It became Amber's another play area, her study area, and that's where my husband does his work as well because he's working from home now. Another one would be a tumble dryer. So we never usually hang our clothes outside, of course, because of the weather as well. So we just dry our clothes through the dryer and then once you take your clothes, it's just gonna be very dry and toasty. So there's a plenty of different unique stuff that you can find in a Canadian home. So make sure just to watch later on a short uh, video of this house tour. So see you in a bit. So the first uh, part of my house is our living room. It's the open space area uh, in between the dining area. It's very spacious. As you can see, we do also have a fireplace as I've mentioned earlier. This space is very bright because we have a huge window. And at the same time, we have a very high ceiling. I wasn't able just to show you the round, but this would be a perfect spot in our house. <music> Next is the kitchen area. I call this as a coffee area because it's part of the kitchen as well. However, this side is also leads you to the backyard. But right now, we cannot go outside because of the snow. Usually when you rent or purchase a home here in Canada, it always comes with appliances. Uh, basically, you will have the stove, the fridge, and dishwasher. And it also comes with nice storage. Welcome to my bedroom. Wow, so this is... So, Add some sanitizer first. Give me, give me one hand of yours. This is it. So we're here in Amber's bedroom. She loves purple, so we really have to paint her room purple. And she loves those dandelions over there. And she has this portrait of her. Very nice bedroom because it faces the main street, and she we usually have a very uh, picturesque view of the houses. <music> We're currently now in the office room or guest room. This was supposed to be a guest room, but since no one is really using it, um, and I'm working from home, so I converted it to like an office room. So here's my work desk, and it comes with a nice view from the outside. Welcome to the palace. Next stop is the master bedroom. Um, the master bedroom is very simple. It's also quite spacious. Amber usually call it like a hotel version in our home. Welcome! This is 
is where we keep all the clothes. Then we also have our walk-in closet here where we keep all most of my clothes, luggages, and yep, it's a pretty storage that we have in our bedroom. The master bedroom has also an attached bathroom. It comes with a walk-in shower and it also comes with a, a pretty bathtub here. I don't usually use it, but Amber makes it like her swimming pool. Uh, for watching this video and I hope we were able to give you some entertainment during this um, pandemic holiday again and Amber would you want to say something to them? Um, please like and subscribe watch this video <laughs> Yay! Bye bye! bye.